afternoon wherever you are so in today's video i'll be showing you how to make this beautiful nose cover you know it has been viral you see people using nankara nose cover just as a little means of protecting ourselves against the pandemic the coronavirus so today i'll be showing you how i made this my beautiful fabric nose cover it is a reversible nose cover you can see I can make use of the, this side. I can also make use of this side. But it's fine if you don't want your own to be reversible, you can decide to use the lining or whatsoever. So, so let's get into the tutorial and you see how you make your own beautiful nose cover like mine, okay? To make our nose cover, we need a pattern, a basic pattern. For this so I have a white piece of paper here I'm just marking five inch on it from the edge here I mark five inch then I'm going to mark five inch again upwards so I'll be connecting these lines together to form a square you can see the square so from this square I can go ahead and mark my shape on it so i will take one inch to this side this will be the lower part of my mask the lower center side of my mask then the side lower part of my ma mask i put one inch as well i'm connecting this two one one inch together you can see with a slant so i've connected it together here yeah, you can mark two inches you can mark 2.5 inches but for the sake of this tutorial, I'll be using 2 inches. What I have there is 2.5, but I'm still going to change it. I will change it to 2 inch. And here I have 3.5 inch. You can see? 3.5 inch. Then I'm going to change this back to 2 inches. So I'm connecting the 3.5 inch to the 2 inches to form an arc or a semicircle. So I'm just going to bring from my one inch here to connect the center line so I just connect the curve this way so our pattern is almost ready I have to label it for us to see over there I have 2 inch 3.5 inch here 1.5 inch over there then another one inch there so i'm going to cross out those parts we are not needing those parts that will be cut out so we only need the shape that is at the center be careful while cutting this so you don't cut into your pattern I just go ahead and cut out my pattern and this pattern will be transferred into my material and just get a cutting material of two type you can decide to use the same fabric for the front and the back you can decide to make a lining for it so I'll just cut with my pattern adding half inch seam allowance to it you can see my paper pattern on it I added half inch to it all around the pattern. Okay, so I have my two piece for my front, then the two piece as my lining. But for this, for the sake of this mask, I'll be. It's going to be a reversible one. So you can make use of a lining if you want, but for me, I'm making use of a re re reversible one. So I join the center together. I'll just go ahead and notch this center after joining it together. Just go ahead and notch the two sides. After notching the two sides, I'll just go ahead and place my rubber where it's supposed to be. Depending on the person that wants to use the mask, depends. De, de, depending on the size you are making, 
for this i'm using 4.5 inch rubber because my rubber is a bit stretchy some rubber are not so stretchy but this stretches well so i'm using 4.5 inch of rubber i'll just pin this in place making sure my center i line with each other the center joining of the two fabric must join with each other must be the same so i just pin my rubber in place this way please be careful while doing this just make sure it is properly placed so i'll just go ahead and do the same thing on the other side then pin all around my nose cover so, I have my rubber in place let's go ahead and pin it so I, we have a perfect nose cover at the end of the day pin the other side as well And I'll just go ahead and pin all around the mask. So I have the center placed together. I pin it together then I sew around and stop somewhere around there okay you can see my stitches and where I stopped you can see how I sew it around then stop there to turn it inside out but before then I'm just going to notch all around just going to notch all around the nose cover just the curvy part please can ignore all these other parts I just used to do it because I was cashing from while making it so please you can just notch only the core parts that will be the upper parts of the mask so after notching round the next thing is to turn it inside out with a small opening then you later secure the opening by stitching it on your sewing machine so i'll just go ahead and stitch this part and show you after stitching it in place and ironing it so this is just a simple method of making your nose mask so you can see after stitching the mask in place, I've already ironed it in place, you can see how beautiful our mask turned out to be. So this is a reversible nose mask. You can use either of the side. You can decide to use one side today, then you use the other side tomorrow. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel to get more of our... You can see I made several of this nose cover you can see it here on somebody very fitted and nice on her so thank you very much for viewing hope to see you in my next video bye